hello guys welcome back to the next video in this video we are going to solve question number nine from the isc specimen question paper for 2023 for accountancy if you have missed out the previous videos to check out the entire playlist from the description box below and if you don't want to miss out any future videos then hit the subscribe button and the bell icon this is a sum on pl appropriation account where we are required to prepare a just capital account as well and this is a 10 mark sum all right let's get started here we have ajay and vijay are in partnership with sharing profits and losses and the ratio 3 is to 1 the terms of partnership says that there is interest on capital their capitals are given as 1 lakh and 90 thousand interest on capital is at the rate 6 percent per annum so we'll pick up the items as we go along so let's do the entry for interest on capital it comes on the debit side of pl pro account to interest on capital for Ajay the capital is 1 lakh so it will be 6% of 1 lakh that's coming to 6,000 and for Vijay this will be 6% of 90,000 that will be 5,400 let's do the total here 11,400 so first one is done let's move on to the next one interest on drawings to be charged at the rate four percent per annum all right now if you move down to find out who has withdrawn how much so we see vijay had withdrawn eight thousand on first july 2021 okay from first july till 31st march how many months for how many months he has used that money based on that we have to calculate his interest on drawing so let's come to the working notes so he has withdrawn 8000 right that will be multiplied by 4% per annum that is the rate of interest 4 by 100 and that will be multiplied by number of months so from July if you calculate July August September October, November, December, January, February, March. That's coming to nine months. So that will be nine by twelve. So let's do the calculation. How much do we get? Two forty rupees is what we are getting as interest on drawings for Vijay. So let's put that here 240 rupees straight away on the outer column and here we can mention working notes all right just beside Vijay we can mention working notes so point number two is done as well point number three partners to get a salary of 1000 each per month so two partners salary we have Ajay and Vijay that will be 1000 into 12 that will be 12,000 for each one of them all right so let's write that and add them and write outside so that's 24,000 so point number three is done as well Point number four, Vijay to get a commission of 2% on the correct net profit. So now correct net profit has to be calculated. So let's wait for that. We'll come back to this. Number five, any partner taking a loan from the firm to be charged interest on it at the rate 8% per annum so any partner who is taking a loan from the firm that means this is this interest will be an income for the firm right so be careful here ajay had borrowed 10000 from the firm on 1st october 2021 so this is the loan which ajay has taken from the firm on which he will be paying interest to the firm and again that interest on loan will be an item of pl account and income for the firm and that is a part of PL, PL account and not PL APRO account, right? 
so that is the interest that needs to be added to the given net profit to arrive at the correct net profit so let's calculate the interest on loan which ajay has taken 10000 is the amount that he has borrowed multiplied by the rate of interest which is 8% so 8 by 100 and he has borrowed this money on 1st october that means he has used this money for 6 months so that will be 6 by 12 right so let's do the calculation how much are we getting that's coming to 400 all right interest on loan taken by ajay so in that case the correct net profit will be the given net profit which is 60000 here before any of the provisions mentioned in the partnership deed so straight away we will write 60000 plus this 400 that we just now calculated so that becomes our correct net profit which is nothing but 6 60400 okay so that is the correct net profit now we can come back to point number 4 and calculate Vijay's commission of 2% on the correct net profit so in that case Vijay's commission will be 2% of 60400 right so that's coming to let's calculate one two zero eight all right so let's put this figure in the pl appro here we have the by pl account where we'll write sixty thousand which is the profit given us for the question then we will add four hundred which is loan which taken by interest on loan taken by ajay and the final amount comes here which is 60400 all right and putting vijay's commission that we just now calculated 1208 vijay's commission is done as well so we have taken into consideration point number 5 point number 4 the interest on loan and the interest on drawings is also taken into consideration at profit also we have taken into consideration that means all our adjustments are done now it's time to calculate the share of profit let's do that how much are we getting Twenty-four zero three two is the profit let's calculate ajay's share out of it ajay's share is three fourth so this amount multiplied by three by four which is eighteen zero two four and vijay's share will be this minus this six thousand zero zero eight six thousand eight rupees that will be their share all right so our pl pro is complete let's complete the capital account of ajay and be very careful here you are dealing with an item which is interest on loan taken by a partner and not given to a partner so here a new item that comes into picture is this interest on loan which ajay has taken 400 comes to his debit side okay because for him this is an expense right his capital account is reduced by that amount let's write the other entries by balance bd we have ajay's balance given as 1 lakh by interest on capital Six thousand by salary, which is twelve thousand, and the share of profit, which is eighteen zero two four. All right, 
and the interest on loan amount is put let's calculate how much is the balance CD so this is the amount 1,35,624 the balance of Ajay's capital account this is the entire sum on PL App Pro and Partners Capital Account. Hope this was helpful to understand and make things clear at a concept level. If this really helped, hit the like button and do share with your friends. We'll catch you all in the next video with the next set of sums that we have. Thanks for watching.